Hey everybody, check it out. Part 2 of the Asterisk War Sucks is already out over on DigiDoes Anime. You can follow the link down in the description. In this episode, we're going to meet the main characters of this show and start to get a sense of what the Asterisk War is actually like, now that we're not just looking at the promo art and the first fight scene. This will not likely be the regular upload speed for this series, by the way. My editor, The Devu, was really determined to get this one finished before he has to go back to work for the rest of the week. And as usual, he did a fantastic job, and as usual, you should totally subscribe to him. By the way, while I've got you all here, I figured I'd talk a little bit about, like, what the point of this series is. I think most people understood, and there were a lot of comments that clearly understood, but there were also some that, uh, it seemed like they didn't get why I'd break this show down in all this detail, why this show. And really the point of it is to sort of like take you through the experience I have when I watch shows like this, particularly the sort of really generic high school harem action shows that are very often made by Studio A1 Pictures. And like it's a studio that I have like a really big issue with, you know, I, I've despised a lot of their shows. And this show has like almost all the problems that I have with this type of show. It has everything that I dislike about A1 Pictures shows. Shows. It has almost everything that I dislike about, like, high school harem action shows. So I'm sort of using this show as a lens through which to view both the genre and the studio and anime in general. Just almost everything that I don't like in anime is in this show. So it makes for a great case study to break down all the problems that anime is capable of having. You could say that if my Evangelion videos are like looking at a show that does so much right and then breaking down like all the interesting things that it does right that set it apart from other shows, this is me looking at every way that a show can fail and breaking down all of the problems that a show can have. So it's sort of the flip side of the coin, if you will. And that's the purpose of it and that will become more apparent as it continues and I'm glad that we got part two out so quickly so we can sort of get to the point quickly and have people understand what this is going to be like because by the time we get to part four it's going to get a lot more broad and not just be like me going through minute by minute which is why this is not this is not in the style of your movie sucks people were asking is this another your anime sucks video like I did with Sword Art Online and it's not like that that was deliberately made to be a your movie sucks parody this is more of me trying to take this show and again explore everything that's wrong with anime so it's not really so much just about the asterisk war and from here i might branch off and in, into uh other related things but we'll we won't get ahead of ourselves here <laughs> go ahead and check out part two in the description and i hope you'll enjoy it